Hey, so it is, oh, so and so again, the Tuesday, I don't know what the date is, is it the 5th or the 6th, I think, sun's shining again, um, and I am about to go to school, or oh, work, uh, for the first time in, since January, so I'm going to, so again, uh, so I'm going into just sort my classroom out, take uh, all my stuff in. When I went in in Jan when I went in in January for the um, <clears throat> insect day, we had an insect day before the first day back for the children, um, and then obviously lockdown was announced that same evening. Um, I bought all my stuff home because I knew I was going to be working from home because I'd already had a discussion with my head teacher. Well, it was almost guaranteed, really because um, shielding was going to happen uh, and then I did go in on the next day so the Tuesday I think it was if I remember rightly it seems ages ago uh, for to pick some stuff up so I've literally got loads of stuff so I bought everything home that I would need so loads of resources loads of books things that I could scan in and like use to, for my planning so I don't have to worry about uh, not having the stuff so I'm going to go and take all that in and do some displays for after Easter and just sort my classroom out. I'm just looking forward to just having, like getting it ready for how I like it. So when I wasn't there, so my class was taught in there and then we had the smallest group of children in the school. So we got moved somewhere else than another because we had to split up, um, we had to split the children up, like nursery up into two different pods. Then we had to move everybody along. So we went into a smaller room. And then my classroom was borrowed. Then when we went back into it after East, after the May half term, uh, May half term, after the East, February half term, sorry. It was, yeah, just left not how it was. So I, the TA who I had in there, I did say like, oh, can you put this there and this there? But obviously when it's not, you know, I know exactly, like I could do it in my sleep, how my room is and how I like my room to be. So I'm gonna go do that today and then hopefully get uh, the most of my work done today as well. And then hopefully I'm hoping to relax for the rest of the whole day until the mad rush when you feel guilty because you haven't done anything. So I thought I'd take you along to see what I get up to. So yeah, I'm just driving to work now. Um, so I will see you in a bit. So I'm nearly at work. I've just been to, I don't know if you can see, you can't see, just been to McDonald's to get some coffee because I said I would for the, the cleaner's gonna be in today. Um, hence why I'm going in, so I said I'd get her a coffee. So um, I've just been and got that because McDonald's coffee is nice. And I'm really looking forward to seeing the blossom tree. So I haven't seen the blossom tree yet um, at school and it's outside my window. So I'm really excited to see that. So I will show you that when uh, I get there. So yeah, I'm just at the red traffic light, but I will see you in a minute. It's snowing. So I'm in my classroom now and I have put up um, the new cups that I got from uh, St. Hughes, which Jake's mum picked me up, which thankfully, um, and I'm just about to start my display. So I've just sorted out the um, bits and bobs that I brought back home. And then I'm gonna do just do my displays now as well. So I have just, so again, there we go. Said it again. And someone commented last time on my other video, you say I'm a lot. And I said, I know. And I say so all the time as well. I just can't stop. It's so weird because um, 
um there you go so you notice it then don't you when someone says it to you um and again so annoying sorry guys if it is annoying i um my sister came into uh school with me once to do some uh can't stop saying it now to do some work experience and we always she always we always laugh at, well we always laugh because she always says and like jake's side to do it now with me she says that all the time i kept going right right year five i don't know if it was in the accent but she said it was but that is my accent so i don't believe it but she said i always said right and like was like come on and i was like don't take the mick out of me so now i'm really conscious that i say right oh i can't uh, find it grind it um and also really also really conscious that i now say um and so a lot but i've just finished uh, my classroom so i got there i don't know what i got there quite, quite, quite early about like thank you i got there like um half 11 so i had a couple of hours and um, the cleaner was in there so we can have our mask on um which that's different too because obviously i was at home didn't have to wear my mask so just gonna do that so i've just gonna have done my display i've printed that's the white one in the back i have put everything back where i need to go although my i had some like magazine files of all my books in but some of them have broken and it's my own fault because when i've carried my bags and i put them outside they're like my classroom's right by the uh, fire exit bridge door so I carried them through rather to there rather than carrying through the whole um, building and left them out and then it started to absolutely it snowed really heavily so and it's just starting to snow now actually even though it's bright sunshine so the weather's really weird today it's been snowy it's been hail and it's been sun so I don't know what's going on so you shouldn't compare at least it's not rain because at least in the snow you feel a little bit excited don't you whereas when it's the rain you don't so yes, yeah, so I'm just on my way back home now. Um, as I was saying, yes, I've printed, I've did, done two displays. One of my displays I've kept up because I think we're carrying on with it after Easter and it's actually quite a nice display with like the children's work and things like that. So I thought I'll leave that up for a little while. It's inside the classroom, then I can change it for my science one after. And I had a science one up and then it was taken down and I don't know where all the stuff's gone. So I need to ask somebody, well, ask the person who took it down, where it's gone. Um, sorry, that was another um, just seen a magpie. So yeah, so I'll be heading home, getting some lunch, and then going to exercise with Jake. So that should be quite nice. So at least I know I've done that, my job have been done that, like that bit of my job has been done. I bought a memory stick home just in case, as I said, you feel a bit like guilty and something like props up so you get an email and you're like, oh, I need to do that. So, yeah, I can do all my photocopying. I printed off like the originals that I'll need and I'll just do that on the Monday morning because I'll go in early enough anyway. And I, if I'm honest, I, when it's, you don't wanna, I don't want to be there all day. But I didn't need to be, so I didn't need to be there all day. So, so yeah, so I am just going to pop to the shop to get something to eat for lunch. And then I will see you when I'm back at home. I have just got home from work and going to get a few bits from the shop. Um, I got this from, I just popped into Marks and Spencer's to need some bread and ham and stuff. And I picked these up for, so these like pussy willow um, sticks, which is nice. So I was gonna put those in the corner and I'll, sh I'll show you if where I decided to put them. Cause I've moved one of the planters um, from the corner by the sofa in the kitchen to the living room. Um, so I'll show you, but I want something else to replace it and um, I could get the same planters, but then it's like spending another £50 just for the sake of moving them. So I want to see if that will work on a little side table first. So I'm just about to do some lunch and then I picked up some more grass seed. Uh, so we're going to do the garden again. We had, did one bag yesterday, but we're going to do another two bags and um, just to make sure it does grow nicely and do the front as well. Uh, so yeah, so that is the plan for this afternoon. We're putting the grass seed down, or we are, I am putting the grass seed down, as I said. And you can just see where we move the aces at the back, there's a big patch of like mud. And then in the middle where we went a bit crazy uh, with a bonfire on bonfire night, there's also a patch of mud. So we're just going to cover it with 
the grass seed and hopefully it will grow well. The rest of the grass grew really well because to start with this is all mud. So it's done really well and we just want a nice level area ready for the summer. Once put the grass seed down, it says you need to water it uh, till it's, I think it said till it was dark brown, but I didn't really understand. Did it mean like dark brown and then once it goes back to light brown, you water it again? But we water it every so often and it has been raining um, the past few days, so hopefully it will be okay. We'll probably give it a water um, at the weekend as well. We're just lying down now watching, um, what are we watching? Um, Lord of the Rings. So I've got my dressing gown on, got my blanket, got the pillows because it's absolutely freezing. Um, so we're just gonna watch Lord of the Rings and then we're gonna go and do our exercise. So I will see you later. We also went for a walk after our exercise and managed to see the seal, which is near to us, which was cute. I'm just cleaning up from tea here. So just washing everything up and putting it away. Uh, ready to relax for the evening. Then into the kitchen and just giving all the sides a wipe with my method antibacterial spray. Uh, just to have a little evening clean and then giving everything a hoover and then using my flash speed mop to give Everett a quick mop around too. I am in my bedroom now, I'm just about to put this lovely pile of washing away um, and I have done my jobs, we've had tea I had a salad and some, a rack of wrap pizza, you know, when you just have a wrap and you put the um, the stuff on. So I had that, I put my glasses on. Um, I put, we were watching the film earlier, we watched Lord of the Rings before we did our workout, which was quite nice. Um, and then I'm just about to paint my nails, because, um, yeah, they come off and need a shape and that. So I'm going to paint my nails and then I'm going to watch The Line of Duty and catch up on that. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed this day in the life. I feel like, I think more so than other ones, I've spoken more at the camera. So please let me know down below if that's something that you like or you just like seeing the time lapses. Um, I try to include like literally everything that I've done today bar, well, I think washing up's boring, but I don't know, you might enjoy it. But um, I'm the cleaning people seem to like. Uh, so yes, I'm just about to do my nails, watch Line of Duty, and then I'm going to have a cup of tea. So I hope you have a lovely rest of your day, or whenever you're watching this, um, I hope you're okay, and I will see you in the next one, guys. Bye! <laughs>